Alright, so here it is, my review of Watchmen. I did go and see this opening day on Friday, but due to circumstances beyond my control, I freaking was buried along under a buttload of stuff I had to do taken care of. So I'm finally getting it all together, posted for this Monday here. Well, hopefully. <laughs> Who knows, if I get more stuff on my plate, it may not be tough to roll. I digress. This was an excellent movie. Um, a lot of scenes were a panel by panel, a uh, direct depiction of the original graphic novel. Um, this graphic novel being almost 20 years old, it was unique to see it, uh, an adaptation so uh, completely done. For the most part, a lot of dramatic licenses in most pictures will be taken. Now, some people have said that the ending of the movie was completely different. The ending of the movie was not different. The catalyst for the ending of the movie was modified, and accurately so. I think the, the modification they made to the ending was very soothing seen as the original from the graphic novel would have been less much sure uh, accepted by the audience it's just without having that real passion a lot I would agree with a lot of critics I've heard that say you need to see this movie twice and you do the the in-depth connotations of the characters and such is just very developed, you know, and the subtle nuances. Rorschach, phenomenal. Um, there were a lot of uh, comparisons made with the voice being that, like, the Dark Knight, which is alright. Uh, it does draw on you a little bit, that real deep, just <laughs> kind of thing. But it, it carries, you know, he was probably the most rounded thought out character I did however think that the amount of blue penis was a little excessive yeah uh, good old Doc Manhattan um, he's all and it's it's fitting though I totally understand what they're trying to do here they're trying to represent the fact that Dr. Manhattan is so far beyond the conventions of uh, normal decency that he doesn't give a crap about what he wears. But, you know, it was just a little too much. They could have shown it once and been like, okay, yeah, we get it, he's naked. Anyways, um, all in all, freaking a very, very well done movie. Uh, my buddy Adolf, he has a couple words for it. Well, boys and girls, you know what I say about movies? I love movies. And yes, this did have it in me. There was a, a, a very nice little uh, romantic scene where these people had a very nice interlude in the ship. It was, it was beautiful. It was just like, oh man, you know, you could feel the passion. It was, it was something, man. Of course, there was this one, uh, uh, you know, like threesome between uh, Dr. Manhattan, Dr. Manhattan, and this other, uh, whatever her name was, Scylla, something, 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 something. But yeah, it was crazy, man. It had the things I liked. The, the, the violence wasn't, it was weird because the majority of the violence was all just brutal and yeah. But no real gun violence. But that's okay, because violence is violence. Violence is good. I love you some violence. Um, yeah. But yeah, boobies were good. So, uh, I definitely give, uh, this, uh, movie... Five smiley faces. And, uh, put that blood on there. Yeah, the five bloody smiley faces. Woo! Good movie. I'm a hat. Fix it. Freak, man. Watch your own freaking hat. Freaking guy. Alright, so yeah, obviously Adolf loved it for because it... His very simplistic criteria was fulfilled. Uh, and my criteria was actually fulfilled for what I consider a good movie. But there was a certain something that I just walked away. Like, it was two and a half hours-ish long. They probably had enough unnecessary free time in there. They could have cut off about 10-15 minutes. There are some parts that just, like, dragged out a bit. Still an awesome movie. Um, my final review, four stars. 
all in all, still a movie worth watching. And for those of you that want, that were fans of the graphic novel, you most likely will enjoy this. Trick man, it's Monday now. For if you're a fan of this, you've already seen it and you already have your own opinion. But if you haven't, hopefully I can convince you that it is worth watching. So once again, four stars. Good day.